Welcome to SNN. Today is Thursday, March 8, 2012. It is a sky day, which means start periods 1, 3, and 5. Last late start day until June, so hope you spend it well. We won't see another late start until June. Reality is tough. Sorry to give you the bad news. But the upside, we have spring vacation in April. Think about that four-day weekend in May. We have Friday the 25th and Monday the 28th off for Memorial Day weekends. Then in June, we have three late starts in a row. Still thinking we're pulling your leg? Check the back of your planner. All of the dates are right there. Birthday today for Kenneth Graham, a Scottish writer. He wrote The Reluctant Dragon and something else. Hint, hint. Both books were later adapted into Disney films. Today is his birthday. When J.K. Rowling, author of Harry Potter, was little, she had the measles and she recalls her father reading her this story. She doesn't remember the measles, but she does remember the story. The book is the subject of our phone in Thursday question. Name the famous story featuring characters Mole, Ratty, Mr. Toad, the wealthy amphibian owner of Toad Hall. There's also Mr. Badger and Otter and Porty, Portly. Wait, wait, too many hints. Sorry. The hints. <laughs> and the winner will be announced at the end of our broadcast. Call extension 78293. Little Bo Peep has lost her sheep. And can't tell where to find them. That's about the only thing that isn't in our very own sky which lost and found. Are you pretty bad at keeping track of your stuff? Well, check out the lost and found located in the main office. There are bags of coats, sweaters, hoodies, sweater, hoodie, coats, scarves, gloves, mittens, hats, Sweater hoodie coats? I don't know what to call them. There are even things that aren't clothes, like notebooks, pencil cases, lunch bags, and nameless planners. People, there are even glasses. <laughs> See what we're talking about? Bags and bags of lost and found items in the main office. There's even a closet where more recent stuff is located. If you've lost something and can't tell where to find it, then just check the bags. You have until March 16th. That's next Friday. After that, all unclaimed items will be donated to charity. ASB has a variety of activities on the calendar for us, starting with March 16th. That's next Friday. It's time for a dance. The theme, a walk in the clouds. We are Sky Ridge after all, so we're close to the clouds and the sky and... Again, save the date because that's March 16th and that is also next Friday. The dance is from 2.45 to 4.15. Tickets will be sold next week at lunch, starting on Wednesday, March 14th, continuing through the 16th. Pricing information is here. Take a look. You can buy one ticket only, and checks must be made out for the amount. No change can be given. And there will be food at the dance as well. Then, there's something else coming up. Get ready to show your Skyhawk spirit. This is after spring break, but we'll be telling you about it early, because it starts the week we return from break. Mark your calendars because April 9th through the 13th, there is a Spirit Week of Dress with an assembly on Friday. Monday is Comfortable Day because it's the first day back from spring break. Think sweats. Tuesday is Gender Wars. Girls wear blue, guys wear red. Wednesday is College Day. You can wear apparel from your favorite college. Thursday is Twin Day and... Friday is Color Wars. Sixth will be in white, seventh in blue, and eighth maroon. This Sunday, something amazing is going to happen. Daylight savings time begins. That means we all have to set our clocks forward an entire hour. Well, we lose an hour. But we gain light. Get ready to set your clocks forward. It happens at 2 a.m. on Sunday morning. That light is just what we need for track. Exactly. The first day of track practice is on April 9th. Also, the Monday we return from break. Between now and then, you must get your paperwork ready. Start now if you are thinking about being part of track this year. Get signed up in the main office with Mrs. Button. Don't lag behind the others. Join track and keep up. Your coaches are Mr. Condon, Mr. Houston, Miss White, Mr. Blair, or Mr. Hunting. All of them are available to answer any questions you might have. Uh, speaking of Mr. Hunting? Oh yeah, there's a Science Olympiad meeting today after school. Be sure you were there. Registration deadline is March 9th, which is tomorrow for 6th graders interested in volleyball. For more information or registration, go to camuscommunity.org. Take a look at Google today also. It is International Women's Day. There's also a reminder from Google about the doodle for Google deadline, which is March 20th. Which is about two weeks away. Better start wrapping up your designs. See Ms. Richards in room 123 if you have questions about your submission. Answer to our phone-in question today was, 
Wind in the Willows, answered by Lindsay Leith Leatham in room 123. Congr our first sixth grade winner. Congratulations, you win 50 fake bucks. Our quote today, which is from the winning book, spring was moving in the air above. And the earth below and around him. Weather report says spring is in the air today, so enjoy the day. Follow the sky code, which means be safe, be respectful, and be responsible. This has been Madison and Lauren. At this time, please stand for the pledge. Ready?